Orange County has cut its jail population in half, and judicial leaders say this happened with the help of new bail reform initiatives. CBS 17's Jimmy's Price takes a look at how these policies are giving low level offenders a second chance. The Orange County justice system has made changes on how it handles people who fail to appear in court on a low level misdemeanor charge. It's a new way of looking at non appearances and giving people a second chance um, who have failed to appear um, because we know there's a, a multitude of reasons for why those failures to appear happen. Typically, if a person didn't make their first court date, an order for an arrest was issued. A small cash bond was set and a person was held until their first appearance. Caitlin Finnegan, Orange County Criminal Justice Resource Director, said these were people who did not need to be in jail and the practice largely impacted people of color, people experiencing homelessness or behavior health issues. And so we were seeing occasionally people that would come in on a very serious violent felony and be able to post a $100,000 bond. And then people who were coming in to our jail for a failure to appear um, on a second degree trespass case um, and couldn't make their $200 bond. So um, we had a, a real disparity. The new policy changes that. For class one through three misdemeanors, district court judges will go through this checklist where the judge evaluates each failure to appear. And if it's the first failure to appear, um, they are given a new, um, just a new rescheduled court date by the clerk um, with information um, that, you know, that helps them um, understand what resources might be available to help them get to court. Judges still have their own discretion and repeat offenders could be issued in order for arrest. These new efforts will be evaluated and the results will be released next month. In Orange County, Jamise Price, CBS 17 News.